What's up, everybody? Welcome to Podcast Now. I'm Alex, and in this video, I want to talk about the biggest problem with having Dumbledore in Hogwarts Legacy. Now, I'm a man that tries to see all sides to a situation, or at least, yeah, again, I try to. I don't always succeed there, but I made a couple videos before, I think like three or so, talking about Dumbledore in the game. And make no mistake about it, this does not uh, negate anything I've said before. I want him in the game. I think he would work in the game. In fact, I made a video talking about how you could implement him and how it could work for the entire game. Okay, so I've, I've made that video before and we've talked about you know if it's possible please do not come at me with it. he there's no way he can be in the game there is it just has to be a very specific set of years it only works if it's in the 1890s uh, specifically certain years in the 1890s not even all of them so I do get we're talking about a very tight range at the same time the original uh, kind of report or the original thing Hogwarts Legacy did say is that it would take place in the late 1800s and then they changed it and now it just you know remember the trailer just says the 1800s in general now so they really left themselves open for anything that uh, that, that can happen. But I, I want to talk about the reverse of it in this video because I do want him. I do think it could work. But I also want to talk about potential problems that could come if you do have him. And really, there to me, there's only one. And the, the one thing is him being the center of attention. That that would be the main problem. So I guess the idea here, right? And I and this is something that people have told me too. That that you know these are things that they uh, don't really like the fact that Dumbledore could be in the game because he could take away from you as a main character. I think I think that's valid. I do. I think if you add him in the game, there's un there is, there's no way around it. He's such a pot. I mean, he's my favorite character in the wizarding world and the harry potter franchise any of that dumbledore is my my favorite i don't know about you guys you can let me know in the comments who's maybe your top five or top three but he would take eyes away i don't even well here's the thing i don't think he would take eyes away from you like the main character just because you're gonna be the main character the entire time and you're gonna be with them right you're gonna be making decisions and i do think games where you can make choices and kind of just experience life and kind of define your character. I do think there is some sort of like you are them. Like there's that that kind of connection. I don't know if it's necessarily as strong as like just uh, like say like a Nathan Drake in Uncharted, right? Where you just have the main character. You know, you could argue that one way or the other, but I do think there is a strong bond you make with a character that you really design as your own because you you know, I mean you're playing as yourself in a way. What I do think Dumbledore would take away from is pretty much everything else. Again, not really spells, not classes, but mainly friends, I would imagine, right? Because if he's in the game, then it's like, okay, well, who doesn't want Dumbledore to be your number one friend? There's also the power aspect. I know I saw some people, I think they messaged, uh, even like direct messaged me on Twitter talking about, yeah, you know, like Dumbledore is so powerful and he always was. Like he was the like, top of his class and all of this stuff. He was always a very smart kid, like a kid going into a very old adult. And it's like, so if he's in the game, I mean, he'd be more powerful than you, you know, probably, right? Like, don't you, don't, I don't, maybe not, maybe not, but he would be a very powerful character. So, like, power levels would maybe feel weird. He would maybe take the spotlight away from friends. And, you know, we've talked about how do friends work? Are they randomized? Are there a couple friends per houses and you can, like, pick? Uh, or, you know, you can't have friends that are outside of your house. You know, how exactly does all that stuff work? But then you had Dumbledore and it's like, well, everybody you know what i mean everybody's gonna want to do that and like again like uh, what i was saying locking you out of being friends with people maybe not in your now i don't know if that's gonna happen it's just an idea i've thrown around before and i think it's gained traction because i think a lot of people have talked about it you know online specifically so you know i, I don't know how it'll work but you know if if there is some sort of lock where like if you're a slytherin you cannot be friends with the two main friend characters they've created in the Gryffindor house right say like just say that's a thing but then also like okay well you have Dumbledore and it's like well is that you're gonna you can't you have to really stop there because there's really nobody else of of that level of importance at Hogwarts at the time I mean like we may we're gonna be able to figure out the headmaster or headmistress and, we'll, and that'll you know depending on the time period and that'll be fine that'll be cool for like the wizarding world lore like I'm excited for that but this you know at the same time it's gonna be like well you can't you know, like Grindelwald wasn't in Hogwarts, so you can't do anything like that. So you're going to have Dumbledore, and then you're going to have, like, five other created friends. Like, are they going to even be remotely as close? And then you have to pay real, you know, for uh, those of us that are worried 
that they may not do their homework on just like knowledge of the wizarding world then you have to worry about them doing like homework on Dumbledore specifically right because you don't want to mess any of that stuff up and there's that aspect too uh you know you know if you put Dumbledore on not only is all eyes on him when you're playing the game like literally you're going to want to be his friend you'll want to talk to him you want to you know experience all the dialogue choices stuff like that like that'll definitely be a thing you do but even from like an outside perspective like looking in on the game it's like there would be a lot of pressure that'd, that'd be like making an open world like, like kind of like this literally open world rpg kind of thing but then just like throwing harry potter and it. it's like well now you gotta really you gotta do your your homework you know what i mean you gotta really make sure you nail who he is and i'm not talking about the movie spin you know the movie tying games because those don't count in my opinion but you know you have to do it right and that's uh that's a lot of pressure on them and 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 there's already a lot of pressure on them for the entire game considering you know it's the wizarding world so it's tough. You know, I would say if you watch this video alone, you'd be like, Alex hates the idea of Dumbledore. And there are a lot of issues with having him in the game. And I, I agree again, like, I don't look, I'm not, I'm not closed minded for a lot of things. Well, maybe some things in life, but if, specifically for like games and entertainment, I really do try to see all avenues. And if you disagree with me on these things, it's, it's totally, totally cool. I am a huge fan of the idea of of putting him in the game. I really think there's ways around the stuff I just said. I think you could make it work. I think it would be generally okay if done right, I guess, right? But at the same time, you know, I'm not stupid. I'm not ignorant. Like I know like there's a lot there there's a lot of potential problems. And I also know again the odds of it happening, they're not as low as I think everybody thinks they are, okay? Especially from what we've kind of seen from the trailers, you can kind of, you know, if that is a black as the teacher that we see in it, then you can kind of start to place where we are time period wise at least <laughs> at least if they follow the time period right so i don't think we're as far away or again like i don't think it's a, like a zero percent possibility i definitely think i mean look if, if they if you're in hogwarts in like eight let's just pick a year well i okay I believe dumbledore was at 91 or 92 so let's just say 93 just to be safe either way if you're in hogwarts in 1893 dumbledore's there factually he's there so like that's it. That if, they, if that's what they chose to do. Now, they have many years that they could pick that he's not there, but it's possible, you know what I mean? But, uh, yeah, there's there's definitely issues. I won't, I won't, you know, kid myself and say that there's zero. I think he takes away, he would take away from all the characters. I think even with, like, the villain, it'd be like, well, don't you want Dumbledore's help? Or wouldn't you want to try to get Dumbledore's help? And then if he's not, if he's not in it enough... You could have people complaining. If he's in it too much, you could have people complaining. Again, you have the idea or possibility of them messing it up, right? Messing up his character or just doing something that's maybe outside of what you would expect from him. I mean, there's definitely... And then, like, again, his power level is so... he's Again, he's so smart. He's so good at, at magic. It's like, well, does he kind of conflict against you you know what i mean so it's like it's there are issues there. there there's no doubt about it so let me know what you guys think about all this in the comments below make sure as always you guys are subscribed bell icon turned on so you know all these videos go up all my social media is in the description below if you guys want to follow me on twitter or subscribe to my second channel or support us on patreon or youtube memberships all the links are in the description below thank you for watching guys and i'll see you all on the next video